Hi guys, welcome back to Moat Cottage Homesteading. If you're new here, I'm Elisa, and this is a small space homesteading channel based in Australia. We grow a lot of our own food, meat, vegetables, herbs, and fruit, and we put it up so that we can enjoy it for the whole year. Obviously, we can't grow everything. We're not growing flour or grain for our birds, but we, we're doing a lot in the small space. I came off a thousand acres and I'm doing a lot more here than I was doing there. And a lot of that is basically because I have more skills now. So I think skills are really important and you can't know everything from the start. It takes time, but you guys are really lucky. You don't have to work things out the hard way because you guys have the internet and you can learn so much from YouTube. So if you wanna find out other things and see what else we do here then hit subscribe also you can check out some of my older videos there's some really good information and you can gain a lot of skills and knowledge in those as well I wanted to just check in and see how everybody was going and make sure you're all okay with everything that's going on with this virus I hope that you're all well and I wanted to know what you guys are doing if you're in lockdown, if you have enough food and what's happening with you, what you're doing with your time at the moment or are you out working? There's a lot of people still having to go out and work. For us, half the family is home and the other half is still having to go out and work and the ones having to work are in hospitality so it's a little bit dangerous I'm not really happy about them being out I'd rather have everyone at home and put a big padlock on my front gate and only let the mailman bring mail <laughs> but we have to do what we have to do and this is where we're at at the moment so for us I'm in lockdown which I, in my life that's not much difference because I have health challenges anyway so I'm pretty much housebound anyway so uh, it doesn't make too much difference for me in that aspect but we are unable to get food unless I go out and get it and I don't normally do shopping I normally have it delivered and there's not deliveries aren't really happening at the moment so we're making do with what we've got and that's okay for now so what I have been doing in between resting and trying to keep well is preserving. It's autumn here and that means I've been picking all the tomatoes and making room in the vegetable garden by pulling up the old tomato bushes and planting new seeds for the winter so we have plenty of silver beet, peas, snow peas is something I've planted and kale. I'll be planting some garlic coming up in the near future. I've been processing ducks chickens we don't have that many eggs coming in at the moment so not much has had to happen on that front but I have been preserving things like the tomatoes potatoes sweet potatoes plums peacherines pears mushrooms I've been making up casseroles and preserving meat which I've made some videos on and then I've got these avocados I'm going to be making some guacamole and that's the good thing about having skills is that when you get given some food, you can do something with it and it doesn't go to waste. I do have a video on making guacamole and freezing it. So if you want to see that video, I will leave the link in the description below. So I just wanted to check in quickly to see how you were all going. I hope you're all doing well. Let me know in the comments below if you are well, if you're quarantining, if you're having to go off and work, if you've got enough food, what you're doing with your time, if you are locked up at home, and if you're keeping in good spirits. I'm gonna be making some videos coming up in the near future, so I will see you in those videos. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.